five men are dead after an alleged shootout between the police and alleged bandits in Trumaka, Kalavantil. Three of the victims have only so far been identified as Meshach, Crash, Douglas, Shaquille and Kadeem Williams. Initial reports indicate that around 10 p.m., police were on patrol in Trumacac, Lavantil when they were shot at in their marked vehicle. The officers attached to the interagency task force returned fire. It is believed that four of the men died on the scene, while the fifth died on the way to hospital. Police say one officer was shot in the chest but was saved by his bulletproof vest. Officers reportedly found two firearms on the scene. There is no good, to, good end to bad deeds, bad company and a life of crime. This from Prime Minister Dr. Keith Rowley in response to news of a firefight between police officers and civilians which left five men dead. A release from the office of the Prime Minister said the loss of any citizen's life through violence is particularly traumatic for any family and community where it occurs. This emotion is multiplied many fold when young men arm themselves and engage law enforcement officers. The Prime Minister urged the young men who may see opportunity through the power of illegal firearms to instead grasp the opportunities which the country offers all citizens. He said rewards which are assured if we embrace our national watchwords of discipline, production and tolerance. On the heels of the police killings, there have been reports of protests by residents in Trumacac. Police Commissioner Gary Griffith is again warning protesters not to break the law. It is your right to protest um, and the Trinidad Tobago Police Service would support you and protect you and provide you that opportunity to protest. What we would not allow is to protest in a way that you would break the law and in a similar manner to what happened with the UE students. Uh, if it is that you can protest, you can protest at any time and as, as I stated, you will get the approval of the Commissioner of Police for you to protest. We will provide the security for you to protest, but you are not going to protest on my watch by blocking roads, throwing debris, burning tires, and feel that like that is going to be your right. 